Welcome back to my channel. I'm Lorena if you are new. Today I'm doing part two of my spring decorate with me. I'm going to decorate our entryway as well as add some spring touches to our upstairs built-in shelves. So I hope you guys get some ideas and enjoy. I had this decor up for the winter months and it's definitely a darker moodier color scheme so I'm going to brighten it all up I'm just gonna remove everything from the table wipe it down and I put the gray lamp back in our guest bedroom and I'm gonna bring back this white lamp which I feel just goes better with the spring season and definitely makes this space feel lighter and airy I am bringing back this space, which I use a lot here in the entryway. I really like the shape of it, the height that it has for the florals that I'm gonna use, and that neutral color. And these are all of the decor items that I'm going to be using. Lots of just brighter whites and florals. I'm also going to use some candlesticks, but they're gonna be close to the florals, so I'm not gonna light them when they're on the table, but I am having them just lit here. That way they can have more of that dripping wax look, which I really like. And these are the florals that I'm going to use in this space. They are a very tall statement piece of floral, which I really love. It's a perfect for those spring and summer months. I'm adding these tapered candles that are from Amazon and now they have that drippy wax look which I think looks very pretty and using those brass candle holders that are from Target and then just to finish this look off I'm using this candle snuffer that I got recently from Magnolia. I really love that pattern that it has and I think it completes the look. On the other side, I'm gonna set this decor book and place a decorative bowl on top. I also got it from Magnolia recently and I think it is so beautiful and decorative bowls are great on an entryway table if you wanna use it as a catch-all. But I'm gonna style this with these dried yellow flowers. I just tied some twine and I think it gives such a pretty spring touch. On the blanket ladder, I'm gonna place a new throw that I got from Home Goods recently. I love the soft color, the lighter texture and feel that it has. I think it's perfect for those spring and summer months. And then I'm also going to place a woven basket that I got from Target, I think like two years ago. And I'm gonna add some faux flowers from Hobby Lobby. I love the colors on these. I think they are so pretty and perfect for spring. On 
the other side of my entryway I'm just gonna switch out one of the frames it was broken on one of the corners and I had taped it but it was time to replace it for a new one I got one from a target that I think is perfect for spring and summer months and I'm just switching out the picture that was already there I love just getting some artwork from Etsy and printing it out at Walgreens it's really easy to do and I usually do this for each season here on my entryway so I think that this frame is perfect for that and then I'm also going to hang some dried flowers to the hooks that I have I got these from Michaels I think they are so pretty I'm just making them even and I'm gonna cut the ends to make them straight I'm gonna tie some twine and just hang them from the hooks and I really love how this ends up looking little corner I'm gonna add this stool from Hobby Lobby and a watering can I got from Target last year and I think it adds a very pretty color to this space Really loving our entryway for the spring season and I'm gonna move on to our built-in shelves in our upstairs area I originally was going to just add in some spring touches to the decor that I already had up but I feel like I get really overwhelmed when I try to do this and it's just easier for me to remove everything and start with a blank slate so that is what I did and I'm gonna start with one of the sides and add this vase with these really pretty florals I think these are perfect for spring and that top shelf has a really tall opening so I usually need larger taller decor so I think this is perfect and then I'm just gonna add some tall vases on the other side For the middle shelf, I'm starting with this decorative bowl and adding some tapered candles to the middle with those wooden candle holders. I'm going for lighter and brighter colors for the spring and trying to use more of the lighter wood tones. And then I'm just adding these marble bookends with some books. Still have that little lamp there for some cozy lighting and then adding this decorative bowl with the base filler which I already had but I'm going to add in some greens and dried flowers just to give it more of a spring look. I still had winter prints up so I'm gonna switch them out for some spring artwork and I think the colors are so pretty and they match those flowers that I just put in the bowl really well I'm gonna set to this frame here with this canister that hides all of our remotes On 
on this side i'm starting with the other framed artwork and adding a large vase next to it and since both of these items are pretty big and tall i'm just gonna let them shine on their own and keep it simple and not set anything else on the top shelf and then for the middle shelf i'm starting with this candle holder and adding a remote controlled candle i think that texture is really pretty for spring but then still adds a cozy touch with the candle and then putting this decorative item in the middle and then on the other side just setting some books and a decorative knot For the bottom shelf, I'm starting with these wooden vases, again going with those lighter wood tones and then in the middle placing this open book stand with a book just opened to a pretty inspirational page. I love how this looks but it also feels really inviting just to grab the book and look through it so this is such a pretty way to style your books and then going to place a vase with some dried floral that has a touch of yellow for that spring look. For the mantle, I'm keeping it really simple and just adding back this driftwood which I usually have for year-round decor. Really loving this more bright and airy spring decor for the built-in shelves. And that is everything for today's video. I hope that you guys enjoyed and got some spring decorating ideas. If you are new, I would love for you to subscribe. I have a few more spring decor videos coming soon. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you on my next one.